I am back in the captain's chair after a three month vacation. And I thought that I would start a series called The Captain's Log, where I check in daily to give you some information about where we are in the world, what's happening on board the ship, and maybe some behind the scenes things that you don't normally get to see. And today we're starting with episode number one, sign on day. Started out nice and early. I was in a hotel in Fort Lauderdale, took a cab to the ship where I met up with my reliever, Captain Leo, and we went through the handover, what's been happening the last three months, what's coming up for the next three months. I met the bridge team, which are not exactly the same people that I worked with in October. And people often wonder, does the captain have the same team every time they go on and off the ship and the answer is no because we all have different contract links we sign on and sign off at different dates so there are a couple of new members of the team that I've never worked with before but that's always great because new people bring new experiences with the entire bridge team we went through the voyage plan so we're basically looking at the tracks the legs from point A to point B throughout this entire itinerary for this particular cruise and the reason that we do this is to make sure everyone's on the same page they have the same mental model whether it's environmental operations or navigation I met with the hotel director Christoph to talk about hotel operations, chief engineer, we talked about technical operations. Then I tried to do a little unpacking. I leave quite a bit of my stuff on board and this is stuff that makes my cabin feel like home. A lot of it are gifts from guests, like this painting a bug and my saber. Around 4.15 it was departure time and it's really nice to be in the driver's seat because it's been a long three months and I'm not gonna lie, every time I take the ship over, you do get a little bit of nerves. But the way I look at it is the day that I don't get nervous taking a ship out is probably the day that I need to retire. Once we were underway, I went for a quick dinner with staff captain and chief engineer and now I'm gonna clear out my inbox and head to bed because tomorrow is a big day at sea. But that will be episode number two.